everybody, it's Destiny. Today I am going to be doing a first re first impression review and swatches of the electric palette. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I've been waiting to do this video for a long time now. I think I've had this maybe two, three, three, three weeks probably, something like that. Two or three. This chair is really high. Um, as you can see, it's really colorful, really exciting. You can tell it's just so bright and exciting. I don't know if you guys can see that or not. And like, I mean, yeah, there's a couple dark colors, but even the dark colors are just like so, like they have a lot of personality. And I'm really excited to show all of these to you guys. As you can see, it's already been getting a lot of use. But I really like bright colors and I like a lot of bling when I wear clothes and stuff. I'm just that kind of person. I don't know about you guys. So I, for one, am a big fan of this palette. Um, so let's just get started with the swatches. This is the color Revolt, and um, it's a, like a glittery, shimmery silver color, and it's just so pretty, and I love it. It's called Gonzo. Uh, it's like a blue color, and I don't. I'm pretty sure they maybe named it after the character from Muppets. I hope so because. That makes me really happy. This is called Slow Burn, and it is just so pretty. It's like a reddish orange color. Um, I spent like my whole entire life looking for red eyeshadow. Obviously, I didn't look that hard because I'm sure they're everywhere. But it's not even that red necessarily. But it is really pretty, and it goes with a lot of the things I'm wearing right now. This is called Savage. It is just like a bright, bright pink. Um, I've been using that a lot for. Um, one of my looks that I've been doing a lot for Easter time. I do a tutorial on that look. I call it my Easter egg look. And um, it's got a lot of pretty things on it. So give this video a thumbs up if you would uh, like to see that. That would make me really happy. It's called Fringe. This is probably the main color I use on my Easter egg eyes that I've been doing. Um, what I do is just I put some cream right here and then I pat it with a little bit of fringe. And it's like a turquoise tealy color and it's just super pretty. This is called Chaos. This is another one that I haven't had too much of a chance to use yet because, like I said, it's spring. I've been trying to do more of the brighter, happier, exciting colors. Eh. So many colors. And um, that one's really pretty. It's like a navy, like a bright royal navy blue color. This one is one of the ones that I've been using a lot. It's called Jilted. It's like a pink, purple type color. And I just love it. I think it's gorgeous. I'm not flipping you off. This is my fourth figure. This is Urban, and the camera is not giving it a very good... It's not doing it a lot of justice, but it is actually like more of a purple color. It kind of, in the camera, looks a lot like the one that I just showed you. That was the bright navy blue color. But this is actually purple, and it is called Urban, which I think is kind of funny considering the... Uh, company it came from is called Urban Decay. Maybe they did that on purpose. I don't know. I just think it's a little silly. It's called Freak. It is a bright, bright green. Uh, the camera is not focusing today. Can you see that? There we go. It is a bright, bright green and it's just so beautiful. And I just like to put it on my eyes and my lips and my hair <laughs> and just anywhere that you can put that. I just think it's so great. This last one. It's called Thrash, and I use that more on like the outer corner of my eyes right here, and not so much like toward the brow bone or in the inner corner. A little bit in the inner corner, actually. Um, just not as much as the other ones, but it is really pretty, and actually looks a lot like Freak, but it's just a little bit brighter and more yellowy. And that's all of them. I'm so happy about this palette. If you are like me, and you like to wear a lot of bright colors and a lot of just exciting things on your face, I recommend you go get this palette right now. I think it was about $52 when I got it, but um, <laughs> had a coupon, so I got it for a little bit cheaper. I actually had to save it because it was one of the last ones that they had, and I'm just so happy to have it, and it's perfect for springtime. It also comes with a double-ended brush. I don't know if you guys can see that. But I like it because it's purple and that makes me happy. Uh, as you can see, it's got a smaller side. 
and a bigger side and it's really helpful for these colors and what I like about these colors is they stay on like you some colors you have to like put like a super heavy cream on and then you have to put them like that powder on like other palettes I mean to get them to stay on but these will just stay on like sometimes I'll put a cream underneath but it's really not even that necessary they just stay on all day if you have a really good eye primer I use the Urban Decay age, age defying anti-aging primer. Um, you can find this probably in any Sephora or any Ulta. We don't have an Ulta, but we do have a little tiny Sephora that I like to go in on a regular basis where I got this palette. But um, I've been using that and these colors just stay on so great with that. Um, maybe because they come from the same company, they coincide really well. I don't know, but I really love it. And I hope you guys love it too. I hope you all have a fabulous day today. Hope you had a happy Easter. Comment down below. Let me know what you guys did for Easter. I had a wonderful Easter. We had a fun church service at service church service. We had a fun church service and we went out to lunch afterwards and it was just great. So let me know what you guys did for Easter. I would love to know what if you guys have any specific traditions you guys do. Me and my family, we like to hide each other's Easter baskets in the house and we have a two story house, so that's pretty fun. It takes a long time. But um let me know. And don't forget, you can follow me on Twitter, Tumblr, or Instagram. Uh, I also have a Facebook page, facebook.com slash destinymarie1121. Go check that out. I hope you guys have a fabulous day. Scary fingers. And uh, I'll see you guys later. Bye.